Where's my invitation? Do you just randomly talk to some people? Rookie, you made it. I was getting worried about you. I mean, you should only be allowed to risk your life when you have the Horizon security team to back you up. Ah. We should go to the command room. Yeah. I wanna be done with this. Not because of the game, because it's actually great. There's like our pilot. Come on over, let's chat. I'll explain you later. Pilot, we're in the hangar thanks to you, Diesel and Hearts. Good work on surviving the crazy AI. What is the AI's name? Red? Sounds familiar, doesn't it? I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> it looks like this AI was left to manage the Horizon Station on Palladium, even after the station closed. Red simply kept it operational for 30 years. So much for the Wera Act. Yeah, it seems like Red has been breaking regulations for a long time. No wonder Horizon didn't want us coming here. Well, Hans is going to take a while installing the modified weapons onto the grinders. So why don't you relax? I'm sure we're in for a tough fight out there. So it would be good to keep your energy up. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's gonna be the ending of the game. I wonder how Diesel is doing. I mean, it's not like he's gonna ask us to do something because the project was the grinder. What are you doing, Diesel? Oh, hello, pilot. Hans wanted me to stay in the ship while he fitted the orange belly and weapons onto the grinders. I think he didn't want me having another accident. Sounds sensible of him. I couldn't help but overhear in the debriefing that there is going to be some trouble breaking into the radar stations. Diesel, what level are your auditory sensor set to exactly? I know that the security team is very good at solving problems, but I was thinking that I might be able to help. You want to pilot your grinder, don't you? Obviously. Yes. You are incredibly simple-minded, Diesel. I know I shouldn't pilot my grinder. It goes against the Worker Automaton Regulatory Act of 21. Piloting grinders is best left to humans. You say that, but you still want to pilot your grinder, don't you? It is very small. I could do a good job at piloting it. We'll ask around to see what the crew thinks, Diesel. Oh, thank you so much. You got it. I mean, the most interesting opinion <laughs> would be of Frenchie. Frenchie, may we ask you a survey question? Oh, go ahead. Frenchie, would you approve of Diesel piloting his grinder to help out the security team on the final mission? Oh, well, that's quite a question. I admit I was uncomfortable being on the same ship as a drone bot at first. There are implications to working alongside drone bots, even more implications regarding drone bots piloting grinders. It's associated with shady business practices and worker rights violations. It's not something that I believe needs deregulation in any form. But I've seen enough of Diesel by now to tell that he's not your typical drone bot. There is clearly more going on with him than I originally thought. And right now, stuck on this remote planet, surrounded by hostile forces? I think we will need all the help we can get. Thank you, Frenchie. That's a nice progress. Frank, could you please answer a survey question for us? What's this about? Do you think Diesel should be able to pilot a grinder? Uh, doesn't that go against many laws? Who cares? Yes. Every law? A lot of laws. Look, those laws were put in place to make sure that colonists can find employment opportunities that aren't piracy. Hmm. But there isn't an employment center nearby, and this is kind of an emergency. Honestly, I think we could use all the help we can get, human or not. 
Should be a fun mission. I don't think I have to ask you, Jess. <laughs> You're on yes. Jess, we have a question for you. Hmm? What's up? We were wondering how you felt about Diesel piloting the scout in the final push. Diesel? In a grinder? Yes. I don't have a problem with it. Holding Diesel responsible for things he had no part in is wrong, in my opinion. Look, Rookie, I came from a big family. Grew up in the colonies right in the middle of the economic fiasco. There were no jobs, and all my older brothers became criminals and pirates. Does that mean that I shouldn't be trusted? I trust you, Jess. Oh, thank you. I don't think anyone is destined for corruption. Diesel deserves a chance, just like any of us. Ah, I love her! Hello, Chef. Hello, Blue. Can we ask you a question? What is it? Diesel wants to pilot the grinder he built into our next battle. Do you approve? Diesel built that machine? Hmm. I don't find it easy to trust AI pilot. It's difficult to judge the intention of something created to mimic humans. That being said, it feels unreasonably cruel to deny a creator the chance to experience their own creation. On that note, I will support Diesel's endeavor. Just this once, though. Oh, thank you, Chef. It's pretty reasonable, I would say. Pilot, you look like you have a question for me. I do have a question for you, Captain. How do you feel about Diesel piloting his scout grinder? How do I feel about it? Well, it's complex. Speaking as your captain, I understand why some of our crewmates would have reservations about Diesel. There has been plenty of violence in the struggle to regain a universe where ordinary people can thrive. Poverty, bloodshed, the works. I'm sure every member of our crew has been affected by it in some way. Of course, I don't hold these responsible for what happened in the past. But I think it's worth taking a moment to remember why a drone bot piloting a grinder would cause some of our crewmates pause in the first place. As the captain, I don't want to brush aside the concerns of others on board. So, are you okay with Diesel piloting the grinder? Me personally? Of course I am. I just hope he enjoys himself up there. Interesting. Something happened in the past. Nebru, may we speak to you for a moment? What is it, Blue? Diesel wants to know if he can pilot a grinder into the final battle against the AI and the drone bots. I would like to personally recommend <laughs> that Diesel is allowed to help. He understands his scout more than the pilot or myself. He would be an enormous asset in the upcoming mission. <sighs> pilot? I personally oversee and enforce corporate rules on board this ship. I'm not a member of your union. Horizon's pushing the boundary on automation and their employment every day. Their bottom line would greatly benefit from it. Uh -huh. I'm informing you of this because I do not want you to think I have ulterior motives allowing Diesel to pilot the grinder. So you're okay with Diesel piloting the scout? To put it simply, yes, I am okay with it. I think we have bigger things to worry about right now than implementing the Wera Act. I swear I'm missing something. Pilot, I believe we should talk to Diesel. Well, I understood every point of view. Diesel, we have finished consulting with the crew. And, and what did they say? The crew believed it was fair to judge your intentions without prejudice and let you pilot the grinder. <laughs> oh my, I did not calculate this probable outcome. I should tell Hans. Hans, did you hear that? I'm going to pilot my grinder. What's that, Diesel? Your grinder? Yep, 
Everyone said they were okay with it, so I'm going out there with everyone. Be careful out there, yeah? I'll talk over the details with Mabry, so she knows to include you in the mission plan. Okay, I can't wait. Hans says I should always thank people who helped me, and you've helped me so 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 much, so thank you. You are welcome, Diesel. Unfortunately, I feel like I know where it is going. Let's see what's happening in the mess hall. What's happening in the mess hall? Are you gossiping behind my back? Come, join us. Hey, sit down. We're having a toast before the next mission. Hmm. Well, now you're making it sound formal. Isn't it kind of formal? Not unless you plan on dying out there. We've done a lot that's worth celebrating, haven't we? I guess. I need to reach past the recent memory of the rig blowing up to remember we actually had some successful missions. Of course we did. I've only been with Horizon for a short time, but the Horizon Security Unit is one of the most solid teams I've had the pleasure of being a part of. Aww. Thanks, Frenchie. It's been a pleasure working with you two. So, let's do our very best out there. Let's help out all our friends who need us on Topaz. Let's take down these drone bots so I won't have to battle grinders for the rest of my contract. Let's take down this dish and deep. Yes. <laughs> Red was operating in a manner that I once considered ideal, purposeful. But Red was left abandoned on this planet for 30 years, which means meeting the production hood was not a priority for Horizon Corporate. Red, despite operating to its fullest potential, was useless. That was my greatest concern at one point, but after spending time with you, it's made me consider that there is more to my existence than ensuring that the production quota has been met. I wonder if Red will be able to understand this, too. Anyway, I've talked long enough. Let's go to bed, pilot. Damn, I'm already feeling nostalgic that it's gonna be the actual end of the game. <laughs> oh well.